so uh, last time we were uh, on, you guys uh, started off uh, facing three uh, ruffians uh, that you... Uh, four, yeah, true. No, well, yeah, four, but you killed three and then capture, capture one that you uh, very well tied up. Um, you then made your way to uh, the miners' exchange with the bodies. You split in uh, two groups, uh, one going to bury the, the dead and the two others staying at the miners' exchange to discuss with uh, Alian uh, Thornton. Um, you, uh, so Tamara and Semat, you buried the, the dead. Uh, while uh, Semat got a bit mad at Tamara for trying to uh, loot the bodies, um, it, it's all it's all it's all water under the bridge now. <laughs> sure. Um, uh, yeah, and uh, Fern spoke with uh, Alia, no, uh, about what uh, what they did. Uh, they hid the unconscious uh, ruffian. And they had tea and played games. Tamara uh, stormed in and out the, uh, the the miners exchange and brought back the cart to uh, the uh, Barton's. Oh, we lost Max. Fairly well, Max. Yeah. <laughs> Give him two seconds. Did the app crash? Yeah. Again. It cool. happens. Yeah, it does happen for me too. Are you? Did he left again? Are you there? I'm there. Okay, he's there. Um, so yeah, you brought back the the car to Barton's bar. Uh, Bolton Barters. I forgot the name. Anyway, um, and then you all came back together. Uh, you 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 talk to what you were going to do um, and uh, Alia seemed uh, interested in uh, pushing you to uh, go and uh, clear out the ruffians. Um, you, she agreed to hide the ruffian in the uh, in our back uh, back uh, room in a barrel, <laughs> and uh, you went back to the inn. You add free meal and free beer. Uh, you proceed to also talk with uh, Toblin about uh, brewing beers, giving him a very uh, poor technique and uh, advice. Um, you also spoke with uh, back with Sildar. Uh, he paid the, uh, the money he told you he would give you if you help him come back to uh, Fendelin. Uh, he also said that he was going to uh, settle down in the town master hall and try to uh, help the town as much as he can and also uh, find out what happened to his friend uh, in, in Yarno. Yarno? Yarno. Yarno. And um, after that, you were all heading uh, to bed. What would you guys like to do? Um, are you just going to bed um, and sleeping for the night, or uh, you are uh, keeping some form of watch, or? Um... Well, I'm in the we in the inn, so I guess I I'm know, just but, gonna uh, sleep for I, the night. I think I think uh, Samat was saying that he, he wasn't uh, sure if. He was going to just sleep the night. I just want to make sure you guys are just sleeping and we move to the morning. Well, actually, uh, I would, uh, I would, I would, my wisdom's too high to uh, not suggest the idea of having uh, Keeping watch. someone at least awake for certain time, uh, but still in our rooms so, so that we don't need to be together, but at least someone's awake at, you know, during the night. At least one person is awake the whole but night. I, so. But I think Dolin said that uh, he can uh, wake us if anything happened. 
Yeah, but I don't trust him. That's the problem. And he drank a little too much tonight. It's It may be because of me. I'm not taking any responsibility, though. Oh, shit. I can hear my voice with those, these headphones. Shit. <laughs> Sorry. No worries. Well, uh, I guess we can take turns and one of us just has to stay awake, just listening if anything's happened downstairs or if somebody tries to go in our rooms. So, uh, how about this? We start with the westmost room. And every time, uh, every two hours, we just knock on the wall so that the next person can uh, answer back. Something okay. like that. We just knock on the door, or we wake each other up. The next next room. <clears throat> yeah, sure. I'll take the first uh, first watch. Awesome. I'll take the last because I got spell slots. Hmm. Yeah, I love happens. those spell slots. I'm a sl I'm a slot for spell slots. I'm going in my room while like talking a bit weird like this to my room. I <laughs> so who said <laughs> is uh, it is it comfortable? Is it a good room? Um, well, it, it's comfortable. It's not um, it's not high end. It's very, uh, like, very uh, standard. Like, it's a, a so straw. So it's three-star. Yeah, it's a straw bed. You have uh, a, a coat chamber, um, chamber pot, sorry. And, um, yeah, pretty, pretty much. It's not that big. It's just enough for uh, what you guys need it, need it to be. Well, that 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 that's word free. I'm happy I didn't pay for it. It's not high end for sure. And I will uh, I will mourn the dead of the day, the dead of the day, and um, like uh, I will uh, do a little uh, a little prayer for each and every one that we may have killed today. <laughs> And we might kill tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> and I feel a bit bad, but uh, then I I, I, feel, I, I fall asleep. Right. Who was uh, keeping the first watch? I am. I'll uh, get my cards out. Should we, we like say in which room we are and stuff like that? No, we know. Because <laughs> if some shit happens, there's like. We gotta draw a map, and uh, okay, we'll we'll get there when we get there. <laughs> yep. Well, isn't um, there like there's six room, I think, in the whole inn, and we have five of them, so technically there's no, one you, left. You have six. We have all six. There's an empty room. <laughs> you, you there's an empty room that you have rented. Yep. Nice. <laughs> Next so, yeah, room. Uh, so all the rooms are uh, to you guys and Sildar plus well the rooms were room. free everything was free no yeah I, I got paid back no you, you said no keep it that's right but it was technically <laughs> free I'm just, just generous generous yeah <laughs> it you was a big tip put, you can put it <laughs> However, you like in uh, in your mind. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I kept um... it. That's right. All right. Uh, so yeah, uh, friend, if you can make a perception check. Ooh. Ooh. So, oh my God! Sorry. <laughs> uh, perception. <laughs> it's a big two. Ooh. <laughs> um. Yeah, you uh, you stay in your room, 
you don't have much of reading or anything. You just uh, are staring at uh, the the ceiling, fighting the uh, urge to sleep, and you don't notice anything happening. Nice. You um, yeah, you can uh, go uh, wake up the next watch. Uh, I'm gonna go wake up. Um, tip, 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 tip. By the way, bit, while I was also uh, in my room, I split the 50 gold from oh, so, uh, yeah. Sil Door. We uh, can say that you you spent uh, your watch counting the gold. <laughs> splitting just make stuff. sure, like, going through your inventory. divided by four, it makes. Uh, mm, uh, mm. Yeah. Okay. Or you just make you make four pots and instead of counting you just put one. Yeah, split it. In <laughs> each and then. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm gonna go wake up, uh, Cade. Go for it. Knock, knock, knock. Oh my! It's my turn. I was I was expecting a knock knock joke, but no, sure. Yeah, it's your turn. Gotta go to knock, sleep. Knock. Who's there? <laughs> Me. Me who? Me who who? Okay, I'm going to bed. <laughs> Never want to sleep. And I, I give him up. I give him uh, twelve gold and five silver pieces since he is the second on my watch. If I counted it correctly, 50 gold pieces. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So, okay. Yep. <laughs> Make a um, perception check. 13. All right. Um, I don't know if you have Anything? Uh, you don't have any plus for perception? No. <laughs> We're so like, bad. Um. So. Fuck! Fuck! I knew it. <laughs> what? We all no, get murdered but, uh, in our sleep. That's what he's saying. If there's something you you want to do uh, while you're on guard, uh, we we can say that you're, you're doing it uh, while. You wait for uh, your turn to end, but uh, you don't notice anything happening. <laughs> okay, I thought we were good. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> and also, I'm just gonna go wake up uh, Tamara. Yes, I hear it. I'm awake. So. so yeah, Tamara, you can also uh, make a perception check. Perception. Oh, shit. Uh oh. Uh. Thirteen plus. Uh... Perception is wisdom. Seventeen. Yeah, that's why I'm not wise at all. Um. So as you are um, as as you are waiting on your your guard, uh, you hear faint noises backstairs. I knew it. Now's the time <laughs> to say it. I knew it. Uh, I'm going to just go out and and uh, try to see, uh, like, uh, for the for the. Uh, how do you say that? <laughs> for the uh... <laughs> downstairs, the, 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 the downstairs exactly. I'm going to just go down and just see what happened. Okay, make a stealth check. In a wardrobe, is that you, honey? Yeah. Seven.
The suspense, it's intense. <laughs> oh, he lagged out. Oh, he lagged out. <laughs> Goodbye. Hello. Welcome back. It's not going well. Gosh. I don't know what happened. I just got. I, it, it's like I couldn't hear anything. I had to drop and join back. Oh, okay. I say seven. <laughs> Sorry. I should have said like fifteen. I say seven. Teen. Seven. She said seventeen. Seventeen. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> um. So as soon as you uh, go downstairs, uh, and you walk down, you. You think you're very stealthy, but you're actually making quite a bit of noise. And uh, you just get a chance of uh, seeing someone uh, closing the front door as soon as he sees you. Okay, I, I, I run and I try to just... Uh open the door and, and see if uh, is anything, uh, anyone I can recognize. Um, you make a, make a, um, I don't know, dexterity check? Just to see if you can reach uh, fast enough or athletic. Ooh, athletic. We don't see you, uh, Mr. DM, by the way. I want to see your face, okay, Mr. Okay. DM. Yes. Dexterity or athletic? Athletic. Oh, okay. <laughs> 12. Okay. Um, so you reach to the door, you open it, and uh, you, you just catch a glimpse of someone uh, running full speed uh, and turning a corner. And uh, you, you are able to notice that they seem to be wearing a red scarf. Oh, shit. Okay. I, I try to search in the, in the room if there is something unusual, like a, I don't know, a bomb or something weird. <laughs> uh, make a perception check. <laughs> he did. He did. What's his name? Is dead. Toblin. Fourteen. Fourteen. Um, you you find uh, on the ground next to the door. There's a lock pick. So you just get the feeling that um, as soon as you went down, what you hear was someone trying to break in, because Toblin told you guys uh, he was going to lock the doors. Um. And what you saw is probably someone that was successful in breaking in. But as soon as he saw you, uh, you scared him off and he ran away, leaving his lockpick there. Okay. Okay, so... I tried to lock uh, the door again and uh, go out to my room. Alright. So, uh, yeah, you're... Uh, you can the, the lock is not broken, so you're able to lock it back on, and uh, you go back to your room. Okay. And yeah, I, so with your uh, with your uh, guard turn, your how do you say that your um, your watch, your watch. <laughs> so <clears throat> ending your watch. Um, the the sun starts to rise. Um, you guys are uh, coming to uh, conscious consciousness. Um, what would you like to do? Breakfast. <laughs> so yeah, like uh, at at this point uh, when like the the sun rises and um, uh, you guys come to consciousness, you also like. Uh, her, her, here, people started to come in inside the inn, uh, ordering food and uh, and drinks, and uh, yeah, everything coming up to life uh, after the slumber of the night. Right. Uh, I'm gonna get out of my room. I'm gonna make sure uh, knock on everybody's door. Wake up! I'm out. Let's go get some breakfast. <laughs> And I'm going to head downstairs. 
I'm already there. You're already downstairs, <laughs> damn. Yeah, I woke up two hours early before you guys. I had my long rest. And Sildars is also with you. Oh, okay. What a crazy me? Sildor. Yeah, Sildars is also uh, woke up early. Okay. Um, so, you... so uh, hey, uh, nothing unusual tonight. Uh, tonight we have a a guest. Well, some someone tried to break the lock, and he tried to enter, but uh, when he noticed that um, I was here, well, he just ran. Was uh, someone from the Red Hat? All right. They didn't learn their lesson, right? So he was. Uh... Only one guy? Yeah, it was just one guy. Mm, that's weird. Like, let's check it. One guy for us four. <laughs> Dirt cocky. Yeah, I think that too. I, I, I mean, maybe he chicken. was just he was just uh just looking at I mean just searching for information or something. Hey, uh, Seldor. I know what's the name of the innkeeper. Toblin. Seldor is the other one. Tob at Toblin. So at this point, hey. Toblin comes in with uh, with the food. Uh, well, you, uh, Semat, you already have yours, but he brings food for the rest of the table. All right. Um, uh, hey, Toblin. Uh, I heard there's uh, there's been some uh, some di some disturbance in your uh, on your front door. Anything? Uh, you gotta say to us about that? I... Well, uh, I locked the doors before going to bed, so... Uh, no, I, I didn't notice anything. You you guys were up this night? How about this morning? You didn't see a fucking lock broken on the goddamn floor? No, the lock was still on when I... When I wake up this morning. Oh? Uh, you lock back the door and looking at, uh... Uh, Tamalia? Tamalia? Tamara. Tamara? Yeah, the look was Sorry. good. I just found a... Um, how do you call that? Lockpick. And lockpick. Lockpick. Uh, yeah. That's Is it still good? It. Uh, yeah. I take the lockpick? No. Uh, <laughs> right? Yeah, if you... Uh, let's say you, you took it. Okay, uh, yeah, I have it here. Just So wait, wait, did he enter or did he not enter? Yes, he entered, but, but run away. And when who put back the lock? Me. Oh. You're, you're, you're wiser than I thought. Okay. <laughs> but... That's a compliment. You say thanks. Thanks. Ah, I took a better buy the chicken. Man, if you want the luck pick, I have it here. Just take it. Like, give it to someone. Uh, I throw it to uh, Cade. <laughs> yeah, I'll take that. <laughs> oh, yeah. You're um, the shady one. I I'm going to give uh, shady. <laughs> 12 gold. Here's 12 gold, 5 silver each. It's, oh, uh, that's good. You're due for uh, from Seldor that he gave me yesterday. Do so. I get 12 too? No, you had it already. It's only Thamara and <laughs> Simat that got it. Oh, no, 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 try. Okay. <laughs> I'm trying. So, um, after breakfast, I guess uh, we're going to go back see our little friend. Our friend in apparel. Oh. Getting yet hey, yeah. formation. Yeah. Okay. We going right now? Well, let me eat breakfast first. Exactly. That's why I'm. That's what I'm saying. Is uh, there bacon? Yeah. I'm looking for bacon. Oh, yeah. give me that. Take it. Give yeah, them yeah. the bacon. Yeah, yeah. You only eat you only eat leaves. <laughs> You're missing out. 
I I eat meat. I'm a ranger, but I eat meat because I hunt. Oh, that's right. But Forgot about I don't that. want to right now, so take it. <laughs> you look like a leaf lover, that's why. I always forget. Yeah, don't worry. That happens. Hey, uh, long day, day. Long, long day. What's your name again? I look at the innkeeper. <laughs> oh, Toblin. But like he's in, he's at the uh, the bar at that point. You have to. Okay, I'm going to the bar and uh, say, "Hey, how much? How much would it uh, cost to kind of improve on your security measures here? Like a stronger door, stronger windows, you know, something that can protect us." Cause everybody know we're here and they want our skin. I don't think you want a reputation of having a unsecure inn. You know what I mean? An alarm yeah. spell. And 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 uh, yeah. I I don't know any way of uh, building an, an alarm per se, but um yeah, I'm all all for it. I, I would have to ask uh, ask around in town, like the carpenter and uh, the locksmith and yeah, the the, the blacksmith. To see it. Yeah, like all of those guys. The wizard. Yeah. Is there a wizard in town? I. <laughs> There's a I, good idea there. It, it, it is, but uh, no, I don't know any wizard in town. <laughs> Unfortunately. Alright, and you can pass on the word as well, right? <laughs> the. the yeah, the, the word of uh, you staying here? No! The rebellion. Oh, right. Yeah, I remembered about that, huh? Yes. You're, you're, you won't forget, I'm, right? I, I won't. I'm, I'm all you took, ears. You took notes, right, from our last discussion? Yes. Trust you, because I forget it all. <laughs> and I'm going away. All right. Well, I'm done with breakfast. If um, I'm ready to um, go, what about you guys? So, Sildar is going to. I'm all good. Um, Sildar, you okay. got something? Hmm? Yeah. Um, if you guys want to uh, come by the town master hall to see me, um, we could discuss about like what you guys are um, going to do with those ruffians. I mean, like we talked uh, yesterday, uh, I'm gonna try and uh, contact uh, Alia Torton. You said my new Hella. wife, uh, like Samat uh, keeps saying. Um, but yeah, uh, and if if we want to put this down back together. We'll have to get rid of those ruffian and i mean um if it's more of an incentive for you guys there might be some gold at the end well nobody's gonna say no to gold but yeah. it's right. not my primarily uh thing gold So but I'm gonna get going... up and uh, start but heading I, out. I used to sell that if uh, sell that you're going to say our plans to the to the mayor of the city? Well, do you guys have a plan? <laughs> well <laughs> a Not plan why no yet. But, uh... <laughs> We don't uh, have an information yet, we can't have a plan, but just keep that fucking mayor out of this. Yeah, always. No. I will always. No, I won't say anything to the mayor. Okay. Okay, cool. I'm chewing on bacon. And I'm looking at it suspicious. <laughs> Sloppily? Suspiciously. Sus. 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 Suspiciously. Suspiciously. Right. So well, I go ahead with fork. Who's Fork? For Fern. your name? Fern. Fern. Thank Fern. you. Are you two Fern. coming Fern. too, or just me Fern. and the elf coming? 
A little too much critical role Ford. <laughs> yeah, Ford? Sorry. <laughs> Ford. I am not Ford. <laughs> he started with Ford, though. And then it, it transformed to Ford and... <laughs> yeah. All right. She was Did wrong be... on the per on, on the wrong name. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> All right. So uh, let's go. Uh, where are we going? Oh yeah, that's right. We're going to see Helga. Yeah. We're so we're on our way. I'm uh, I'm keeping uh, my eyes open all the time. Yeah, me too. All right. I'm making uh, sure that uh, Semat keeps his eyes open. So I'm looking at him while he's looking out. So can I'm I ride your shoulders him. again? Yeah, piggyback <laughs> ride. Yeah, I love doing that. You don't you don't pick me though. I I'm climbing. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so uh so you make your way outside. Um it's uh still very early in the morning. Uh, there's still uh, like what what uh, what's Jose in English? Do anyone know? The morning dew. Is it moist? It's yeah, moist. Yeah, it's still <laughs> moist on on on, moist. on the grass. <laughs> and oh, uh, <okay>. moist. <laughs> is... Juliana was like, "What? <laughs> it's still moist it's down moist. there." Okay, I understand the, the word in English. Oh, I gotta, I gotta um, Thank make you a for little, um, I'm gonna equip my light crossbow that's been in my backpack since the beginning of the campaign that I just never <laughs> had it. So now I have a ranged weapon. All right. <clears throat> you put it on your belt or? Because you still have a, sh uh, a shield and um, hammer. Morning dew. Morning Dew. Morning Dew. Morning dew. Uh, That's the name sure. for Rosie. I put it on my belt. Okay. I guess. <laughs> what? Of course I did. Rosé? <laughs> That's kind of wine, right? Yep. So yeah, you, you guys uh, come out. Uh, there is some people on the streets. Uh, Going about their way, it's not crowded. Is uh, any of them are right wearing now. red? Uh, make your perception check. Can I do with advantage because I'm riding his shoulders? So, assuming he yeah, helps me. Yeah, technically, yeah. Yeah. Twenty-one. Oh, oh. Uh, never mind. I'll, I'll retract. I'm gonna do it. No, I'm kidding. It's too late for that. <laughs> no, no, no. That was that was a roll gasm. That was a uh, natural okay. twenty for a twenty-five total. Okay. Ooh, nice. The, it's the um, piggyback ride. All right. So uh, you guys keep a very keen eye on the streets as you make your way uh, down to. Um, <clears throat> to uh, Alia Tartan and the Miners Exchange. Um, and as you, um, so yeah, uh, you, you walk there, you notice everything. So you see uh, a dog pooping. Hey, I saw that kid, give it back. back. <laughs> hey miss, uh, you might want to zip it up. <laughs> I can see everything from up here. <laughs> You guys are crazy. <laughs> um, and uh, at some point, you uh, you do notice um, just a flash, like and, lightning. Uh, not like lightning, but uh, like maybe uh, sun reflecting on um, on some metal. Where? I want to uh, see where. What? Well, uh, it would be, I don't have a, a map exactly uh, of the place, but it would be uh, uh, s like somewhere in uh, some bushes to the to the east. 
Wait, east is where? So like somewhere here that are there are some bushes and we see a flash of is a, it a reflection still there? of metal. Like is uh, it constantly there or is it like just a Yeah, no, just, you like just like a flash. Like you you see it and uh at that point you uh see an arrow flying right toward you. And I'm gonna make an attack roll. On who? And if I if uh, I saw um, it, do I have? A, is it with advantage? Is it advantage? Oh, I guess uh, he doesn't have advantage on the attack because I saw it. Yeah. Okay, he was not hidden. Okay. Well, so if would, if okay. somebody wait. Question: mm -mm. If somebody attacks, they're, they're not hidden. from the shadows. Though my reaction pops. Is protection gonna trigger if somebody attacks? Is I think it's all the time. Your protection? Yes, fighting style protection means anyone that is uh, five feet around me, uh, if they get attacked, they have a disadvantage on their attack but roll. You, you can use it just in in a in a battle. Like, well, like it's a reaction. Action? Since ah, it's a reaction. Okay. I don't know. That's why I'm asking. Oh, it's a reaction. Yeah. Yeah, I think you can. You can do it. So it would apply. So, but yeah. since Wait, he's it's, in it's stealth, it's a reaction. Yeah, it's a reaction. Yeah. That means you can only do it once per turn, uh, per yeah. round. I mean, maybe we've been playing wrong this whole <laughs> time. <laughs> Because, yeah, if it's a reaction, you only have one per turn, so... It's a hidden thing, but, uh, yeah. Right. But we, it, it doesn't matter. We'll we'll know it for the, for the next time. Okay. I, I, I'll, I'll, I'll take a look. What is it? While wielding a shear, a, cre and a creature you can see attacks a target other than you. So... Uh, you can see... Like, Do I have the time to say there's something there so he can see? Or is it just me who can't see? Who can see? Good question. Uh, <clears throat> DM call. No, but it's Fern to win the, uh, the, the reaction, right? Yeah, but Fern needs to see uh, the guy. Do, do I see? I made the, the perception roll, and I saw the guy. So do uh, I have time to say here's something there, so that he can like see and throw? Well, throw, yep. Not, yeah, I I say yeah, yeah, that works. Yeah, okay. but uh, so, that would have been. So he's not hidden. As soon as right. uh, Semat saw it, he should have said. I saw something before you say somebody shot an arrow because yeah, now the arrow there. has been shot. So only Samat saw it technically. It depends what's the, what's the flash. If the flash is before it was, it, it, is it the shot by itself or is it before the shot was it's, made where I would have time to say, Hey, there's something there. It was uh, like the cocked arrow that you notice. Mm. So I saw it before the shot. Yes. Okay, so but, I would have yeah, time. I, yeah. Okay. Makes with sense. Your, cool. with, with, with your perception, I, I'll give it to you. Uh, so he you failed his get... hidden check. So he wasn't, he does not have an advantage. So when he shot, he, he it's a straight roll. But then again, if, if ferns protect me and I'm being I, our. I don't know who's getting shot at. <laughs> uh, <laughs> That's was, an important you, you point. <laughs> you were shooting at uh, at you, but like he, okay, it's, it's so it, he has like, this advantage because of protection. It's hard to um, uh, to see it on the map, but what I wanted to do is uh, like it, it's very far away, so he already has this advantage. Okay, he's just well, okay. Not, not that so far, he has double this advantage. Nice. Yes. But hey, he's up, up the hill there. He's trying to shoot uh, at us. <laughs> he rolls to 40 to 20. <laughs> <laughs> he goes as far one. as his bow can, like 120 feet. 
<laughs> so, uh, yeah, I'm just if gonna roll. If. Yeah. Twenty six. <laughs> it, with this advantage, it's still a twenty. Uh, hits. Um, all right. So, um, let me. If you, mm. it, the, the the arrow hits to foreign or hits to Semat? Semat. Okay. Um, so it's uh, seven points of damage. Ah! And I'm getting shot at like in the. I start. I start to look the guy the who, who. Where did it came from, arrow. Matt? Do you know where it came from? Where the arrow points, but reverse <laughs> over there where it told you. He's on your back. <laughs> Uh, seven, you yeah. said? Yes. So, it would be... Oh, oh, oh. How far, oh, how far oh, would the bush be? It. I have healing wounds. <laughs> Don't waste the spell. Kay. I'm okay. I'm okay. <laughs> oh, motherfucker! And I'm, like, screaming a huge swear word in the middle of the street. I guess where everyone's screaming now because I've been shot at. <laughs> Uh, how far is uh, the bush we're talking of? Uh, it would be uh, three, uh, oh, near yeah. three, 300 feet. So sprinting. Oh, sorry. You are sprinting? No. Oh, he... ye. Yep, I'm, I'm too. <laughs> oh, uh, I'm, I'm gonna... riding him. Yeah, but technically, like, <laughs> this is just fire wise. I'm not <laughs> I guess I don't know how we want to handle. I'm that, gonna but... start running with Semat still on my back, <laughs> and we're gonna run towards where the hour was shot. Because um... you, you, at this point, you see the guy that uh, tried to snipe you, and he, he's just fleeing as fast as he can. Also, do I we see which way he's going? And I try to just. Uh... Yeah, he's going. Uh, he's going to the northeast. Uh, how many feet is he? So uh, yeah, I said about uh, 300, so it would be like something here, and he's just uh, sprinting like uh, toward uh, dimension at this point. I'll shoot him. I get my crossbow out, All put right. a bolt in it, and shoot him. Don't you want to dash? Don't you want to? Why are you stopping? Why are you shooting? What's your range? Uh... Uh, um, with this advantage, 320. Can we roll okay. initiative or something? Or is it a skill? Um, yeah, we can. Uh, I, yeah. We're, we're never really going to catch my, him that much, I guess. It's my first time doing like a pursuit, okay. so. Uh, you got two, two, thing, two ways of do, dealing with that. You can do like a scene, like in the uh, fucking uh, uh, Marvel scene that uses skill checks. So a number of success or a certain number of failures, it requires a certain number of success to succeed. It's like a skill challenge yep. or, and make it like a scene, but no, no really, not really related to math. So you don't necessarily count the feet, but yep. if you want to make it like a mechanic, like a combat, we need to roll initiative and, ca and calculate the actual feet that we're doing. So it's up to you. Yeah, no, I think it's going to be easier for just uh, that guy to do it uh, as um, a run cinematic. Um, so, like, it, you're, you're saying, um, like, how does it work? The, the guy needs to make, everyone makes a, a check and the guy makes a check and you yeah. need to... Yeah, so it's like, harder on the improv I'm, style and I'm for the DM from you the need to react. Yeah, that's right. So each each of us, we, we would still do an initiative, but between us, okay? Okay. Not the, the guy doesn't have an initiative. If we fail too much on our checks, and you determine, so it's heavier on a DM, I would say, because you need to determine a, a, a DC for each roll we make. 
and a, a, a failure rate. So at a certain number of failures, the guys escape, the guy escapes. And it, it, at a certain number of success, well, we, we get to the guy. Okay. So you need to determine that there's maybe like we are four players, maybe four, four failures for eight or six successes. It's about 10 rolls. Okay. So I, I, I... I don't have um, to roll for I don't have to roll for the guy. It's just the success of you guys. Yeah. Well, okay. you, you yeah, need to right. know a DC that uh, it passes or fails. That's right. The guy is replaced by a DC. So the guy is replaced by a certain DC we we'll have to roll against, and you yep. kind of describe the scene as it goes. How how is the guy escaping? How do we react to that scene? It's a lot of improv and role play, but it's. It's it, it's the craziest and it's the most fun for me, but it gets like a Marvel fucking movie where, in theory, in combat, that would not be possible. You know what I mean? Like a, 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 a freaking fern jumping on the roofs or something. You know what I mean? Like in combat, that would not do you know sure with a dwarf on my okay, back. But... Yeah, right. No, no, obviously. Stop, yeah, stop that's over, what I mean. Stop overspelling. <laughs> Overselling it for the first time. You know, there's explosions. It's it's crazy. <laughs> it's just one guy running through the uh, like the field. So, but yeah, I get the point. Uh, yeah. The no, well, the field in a town during daytime. You know, there's people around. There's obstacles. There's a cemetery. You know, he could run uh, through the cemetery we built, and we could have, uh, you know, <laughs> buried it wrong. He could fail, fall into it, or something. You know, it opens to a lot of things. I gotta say good night to my kids and coming. Yep. Back. Okay. I got an initiative of seven. Hmm. My initiative is 11. Oh, no. No, no, no. Uh, 14. Eleven. Eleven. Six. Yeah. <laughs> Gonna use the restroom. I'll use that time. All right. Okay. So otherwise, it's a failure. A D ten. Yep. No. Well, it, um, we. <laughs> It's, we can it's do it the same way. with a 20. But usually it's like skill checks. We use our skills against a, a, a DC that you set. Oh. So if you want to say like all DC is 10, it's okay. But like it's a skill check. Let's say I use my insight to figure out where he wants to go. Right. So I roll a D20. I use my insight. Okay. I tell you the result and you say if it's a, if it's a success or a failure. Usually... I Okay, the, no, I, I get the it. The more, okay. the the more, the more like if, um, effort is put in the description of the act, the lowest the DC. And if it's like, well, I cast this spell, like it could be good, but it's it's not really RP. It's not really cool. It's not really like Marvel like. So you could set up the DC higher, or if the description is not like, All right. but it's. it's people do that this way but you can do it your way as well all right. the time I'm just yeah, no, I, I, I get music. it um i'm just curious to see uh, what kind of uh skills you guys are gonna try to use in the pursuit in the field but yeah that that makes sense um all right so tamara you're first oh okay and uh, uh, it's uh, sorry just one last thing is it three success like as a group or it's uh, three successes. Um, for well, the, one the number of success you person. determine, but it's always as a group. Okay, good. So uh, number of failures versus number of success. If we get to a certain amount of failures, he escapes. If we get if we get to a certain amount of successes, we get him. 
Great. So, so what am I going to do? Uh, I'm, I, I, I can see the guy right now. He's running. Uh, yeah, you, you, you when uh, Samath cried <laughs> that he, he got shot, uh, you, you uh, turned your head and you saw someone uh, like jumping out of bushes and started running at full speed. So I'm going to just run as fast as I can, just running through the people and everything, and I'm going to just, uh, just straight to the guy. All right. So uh, make an athletic check. Okay. Okay. Ooh. 18. Good. So yeah, you you start running full speed and with like your um your grace from being an elf you're able to find your footing on like very rough uh like even in the field where there's like uh um uh how do you call that where there's like soft uh, uh heart heart Pretty. soft art uh and like grounds that is uh that could have made you like fall or anything like that you just uh find your uh your path and you're able to uh get your speed very fast and uh start following the the guy okay like i don't have anything to troll him so i just start to run and i say stop and i let it <laughs> to the <laughs> all right uh so it Cade Stern. Uh, yes. Uh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna start running and try to jump and climb on top of a house using acrobatics. And Maxim mastered the, the skill challenge. I'm gonna try to shoot him with my bow. Oh, all right. Um... Yeah, do a acrobatic check. Twenty-four. <laughs> Twenty-four. <laughs> yeah, I got nineteen <laughs> plus five. So, uh, Seth, with Senat still um, like screaming his lungs out uh, with uh, the, the arrow that he got, you just like. Don't even mind anyone. Climb on Fern and Senat to jump on the roof right next to uh, to them, and start running full speed, jumping from a couple of roofs to get as close as you can. And then you just stop and like take your time, very far away to shoot an arrow, and the arrow like just flies all the way and. Uh, hits the guy just in the ankle and he he, he like he stumbled a bit uh he's still running but uh it, it was enough to like uh, slow him down <laughs> it's Good. a not stern ah, it. i love it when you say that <laughs> um so i'm going to I'm going to scream, By the power of Kelimbor, you will not attack me and get out with it. I mean, I'm, my holy symbol is kind of flashing, and the flash is moving towards him. And I, it's kind of the light cantrip, but modified. So I, I, the, the light is, I push the light towards in front of the guy where he runs in order to blind him momentarily so that he kind of falls on things and can't see anymore. All right. Um, so that's the light cantrip that you're called? Uh, yeah. Well, it's... <clears throat> no, I, I, I have the light cantrip, but I'm... Yeah. So it could be... Ar I don't arcana know. check. Yeah, Arcana. Because I'm an Arcana cleric. <laughs> I have still plus one, so... <laughs> it's a it's a pretty ten. <laughs> <laughs> So um, as you uh, take your um, your uh, symbol and start casting the Kempre, uh, figuring out in your end that you uh, what you're gonna do with it, you just have uh, 
you just have Cade that like <laughs> use your head as a jumping and he just push you down a bit and you completely motherfucker uh, spell <laughs> <laughs> that kid one of these days one of these days and with that uh we move to fern well i don't make sure i don't have a dwarf on my back first of all i'm not even sure if he left but <clears throat> i'm gonna start running I'm still there <laughs> towards him through the field and as soon as i get like a <laughs> A little downhill, if I'm able to. I'm gonna take my shield, use it as a board to glide on the morning dew towards, and I'm gonna shoot him with my crossbow. While gliding you're... down and going towards it. So you're shooting, you're shooting Semat? No. In the field? I'm not shooting yeah. Semat, I'm shooting the guy in the field. Okay. I mean, I'm running towards the guy. No, but I thought you were throwing the dwarf. No, I've could. dropped the dwarf to make sure I don't have like an extra weight. <laughs> Regarde ça, espèce de gourde, tu m'as tiré une flèche. <laughs> okay, so so you drop the dwarf and then you uh, try to I started to run running, yeah. Down. Um... So he's trying to gain speed by, by sh you know, going on his... Uh... Yep. And then you're shooting? Yep. You um... can do that as two separate things if you want or just add the shooting as a... Kind of bonus thing, you know. No, I was just adding the shooting as a bonus while I glide on my shield yeah. downhill. So right. as long as you resume that to kind of one roll, the we same makes downhill. sense. It's, that's it's that's the roll, beautiful yeah. thing of it. Yep. Oh, <laughs> so it's either like do. gaining speed with by surfing or the sh putting your 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 roll into the shooting part, which is like two different roles. Yep. No. Um, yeah. I. I think I'll make you do a um, uh, acrobatic check. Okay. <laughs> I love skill challenges. <laughs> I have a six. <laughs> <laughs> why why so, did you take acrobatic? Not athletic? Come like, on. With everything happening very, very fast. You have this big idea in your head, and you start running and uh, jump on your shield before you realize that it's actually going uphill. So you, you, nice. you don't. You just uh, and you yeah. just finish your uh, your speed going slowly uh, slower, and uh, you just have camera that pass you full speed at this point. <laughs> Making a lot more so, progress than you did. So we got two failures and two successes, is that right? Yep. How many do we need the successes? Should well, I do you, tell you guys? No. You can tell us, it doesn't change anything. Does it? I'll, I'll give, uh, I'll keep the suspense. Oh, All right, yeah. I love it. Okay, okay. I love it. <laughs> so... so uh, Tomorrow, I guess? Yes, Tamara is again. Okay, so the guy is right now like a little slower because uh, the 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 K, when K the, just shoot the arrow, right? Yes. So, I don't know. I'm going to, 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 I'm going to, to pick up some uh, rock or something and I'm going to throw him to just uh, try to, he just fall. He All right. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go on. Uh, make a straight dexterity check. Dexterity See if you check. can um, hit him with a stone. Okay. Oof. Six. So, <laughs> so you you stop, pick up a stone. Uh, yeah, lose your uh, velocity that you have. Try to aim. He's still pretty far. Like you, you gain ground, but at this point, like uh, he, he's still running very uh, as fast as he can. Um, and you, you throw the rock as uh, as precise and as strong as you can, and you miss him. 
similarly. <laughs> like you, can, you don't. Can we say that the the rock is hit by a uh, fern's arrow? <laughs> ferns? Oh yeah, because yeah, fern shot. <laughs> so you actually like you, the shot seems very good. Like it is on point. It goes in straight for his uh, the head of uh, the the ruffian, and then. Out of nowhere, there's an arrow that just <laughs> <laughs> put, made beautiful. the stone go in a different direction. And the ruffian just, uh, uh, at, at this point, he's, he's gaining a lot of ground. And he just uh, reached uh, a point in uh, with a forest. Uh, and you, you lose track of him. Oh, shit. Dang it. Oh, oh. god damn it. I, 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 I scream like, Cade, you can see it from right there. I'm, 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 I'm coming and like running and, hey, did you guys get him? No, I, I, uh, I, I just scream and I try to, to just uh, see if I can just follow the guy. Follow the guy? Yeah, I, 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 I can follow him, right? Because I don't see where where he go. So that's right. Um, well, I mean, you know where you lost him. You oh. you you guys can continue and track him if you. Uh, Kane. <laughs> I'm supposed to be good at tracking. Do you where? And you are high. Maybe you can. <laughs> you can I'm in a that. bad mood. How about we go torture some guy? Yeah, that, that makes more sense than trying to find one guy in a forest. It's probably going to be easier finding information in a guy we already have. It, it's probably the guy you saw already, Tamara. Okay. He's going to he... come back. Don't worry. If he's an assassin, either he won't come back unless we're dead, or he'll come back. Okay, Both so... Both mean the same thing. So, we're going oh. to continue... Oh... Max has best one in the PC. I got a bill uh, for him. I can send it. As do I. <laughs> and RTX uh, 30s are going to be out in, uh, soon. Oh, you're kidding me. No, no. What? You're getting one? Already? Go look at the specs. It's um, something. Something. <laughs> All right, proceed. Hey. I'm already uh, running everything full on. I know. <laughs> like I can stream and play games full graphics without any problem with my 2070. So I don't know why they put that out. There's no game out there that can leverage this. You don't have ray tracing. Yes. No, 2070. What's does. ray tracing? You have an RTX. Yeah. Yeah. You already it, has it. Does it have it? Yep. Oh. Yeah. It's a, a 2070 RTX. Rose Strix. Good. We're dividing. You can play Minecraft with RTX on. Nice. In VR. Uh, in VR. No shit. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I'm bragging here. I'm bragging, motherfucker. <laughs> totally. So, um, sorry. As gonna, you, yeah. so as you're making your way back, um, uh, Semat seems to start like um, having trouble, like breathing, and he's sweating a lot more than usual. Uh, Semat, I'll ask Fine. you to make a constitution. <laughs> Oh. Um, oh. oh, I have to that... wait. Is it wounds or poison? Is it a poison? Are you good there, Samad? Because uh... Uh, I have a dwarven resilience. You had advantage on saving throws against poison, and you have resistance against poison. It is. Ah! Ah! So you have advantage on your. Dave. Advantage and resistance? Oh, I, I rolled the five and <laughs> then I rolled the 17. <laughs> Constitution's 20. Wow. All right. Uh, 
so yeah, you, you you feel very weak at that time, and uh, you you just oh man, and you you're able like to uh, to keep your consciousness. Like you you just have one moment where like everything goes black black, and then it just uh, comes back. Like when you uh, you uh, step uh, when you um, raise up too fast from like a, a sitting position, you get Vertigo. that feeling. Vertigo. Yeah, exactly. And then you shrug it off. Right, right. Uh, uh, I don't feel so well, guys. Wait. I was, I was actually going to say, are you passing gas or something? You, you, oh, you kind of, yeah. <laughs> you, you are definitely a dwarf. It's dwarf confirmed. All right, let, let's go back to the miners, change before more happens yeah that 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 new brew of that innkeeper is uh ugh, doesn't go well it's the carrots yeah yeah i hate vegetables all right let's let's go let's go torture the guy man i'm in a bad mood is it a short rest can we take a short rest there in the middle of the field yeah we will just walk in well, you can. It's not a short rest if you're walking. Yeah, you, yeah, yeah. I think, I think you can. I think you can. Uh, nothing more strangers than eating, drinking, reading, and tending to wounds. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> walking is not one of them. You, you, you can take one of the potions. All right, let's go to that uh, to that place. To the minor exchange. I'll keep an eye out just to make sure nothing else happens. So, beating out a ruffian. Is not part of the short rest. No, okay. <laughs> just, just so we get torture that out. is no, not. I, short well, rest. I thought that light walking was okay, but it's not mentioned. I, I really thought that that like just light walking is actually a short rest. And I've also been playing that, so maybe I was wrong all along. No worries. Oh man, can't wait for my next DM session. <laughs> all right. Uh, so you do make your way uh, to uh, the miners' exchange. You make your way in. Yep, I'm going in. Right. So Alia is is behind the counter. Hey, welcome back. Is he still alive? Is, is that motherfucker still alive? Uh, yeah, I. Well, I mean, I didn't check, so depending on the wounds that you uh, give to the guy, um, he might be dead, but... Um, yeah, yeah, I should be okay, should be okay. No, I'm pretty barrel... sure I'm pretty sure we did um, some thingy just to make sure he doesn't die, but doesn't really feel well that much either. It's some sort of spell Samat made, I don't remember. Uh, okay, yeah, that, that hey. sounds great for a friend. Just, just in case, uh, lady... You're a lady, right? I am, yeah. Okay, sorry. I, I can never tell. You all look alike. Um, sure. <laughs> uh, just in case. We've just been attacked, and someone tried to sneak in into the inn the other night. So maybe wow. you want to... You kind of want to be careful around here, because now they know that we kind of deal... No, that you, you're with us, you know, and uh, I would not want to uh, see a pretty face be uh, pierced by a poisonous arrow. That's oddly specific, but thank you for your uh, consciousness. Um, yeah, I I have my ways, but uh, thank you. Yeah, I'll, I'll I will be on my guard, as I am always. Cool. Can we use the back Let's room for a little uh, questioning? Yeah, of course. Um, Basement. That's the, uh, that's the, uh, yeah. The, as soon as you can get it over with, uh, that would be fine by me. So you make your way to uh, the back room, uh, open the barrel, and it, like, it stinks. Like, the guy just, like, he, he add nowhere to go so he just had to go inside the barrel all over it smells like my grandma 
That's <laughs> part of the questioning process. That's how and you break this point, a man's spirit. At this point, he is conscious. So he, he's just... What's up, my dude? Yeah, so he, I'm gonna get he, him out over the mouth. He has the rope in his mouth because you guys uh, buy him then. Um, yeah. Is there a chair somewhere we can tie him to, like, good old well, there's... mafia, like, movies and stuff like uh, that? There's boxes. There's a, a chair in uh, in the front. You guys can go and pick up a chair or just. I'm like, gonna pick up the chair. All right. Oh um, yeah. It's just like uh, oh uh, um, yeah. All right. <laughs> yeah. Don't you worry. Uh, we'll clean it up real good once we're done. So we're tie him up to the chair. Additionally, with everything that is tied up to him. And I get out my warhammer. I and think we're going to start with a little beating. Do you, have a, do you guys have another rope? Yeah. Well, uh, we all have ropes. I've used <laughs> mine to, to tie him up. So. I got hempen. I got silk rope, 50 feet, and hempen, which... Hempen. <laughs> what? I don't know what that is. So, so crop is <laughs> way too soft for it. It's like, it's like there's the silk rope that is exactly the same thing as a hempen. Okay, they both come in the adventuring gear, and the silk rope is twenty gold, and the hempen is one gold. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know which one you're gonna use. Oh, I'm gonna use the hempen rope. Yes. So I'm uh, tying that up, timing him up, and uh, tying so him up. We're gonna play a little game. Uh, hey, is there any rules here between us? You know, uh, I'm kind of open to a lot of stuff here, but I get the sense that some of you might have uh, dignity. Well, I would say just don't kill him. Okay, that's awfully loose. Well, we're gonna I, have fun. Sorry, I, I'm gonna I'm, add. I'm turning and I'm bashing him with the warhammer. Yet. Yet. <laughs> Roll for an attack with advantage. So, uh, 22. 22? Yep. Um, yeah, that hits. I'm just gonna look at something. Okay. Okay. I just wanted to see if uh, he was uh, incapacitated, <laughs> but he's he's not. To do a critical? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, he's not. Not yet. <laughs> All right, so okay, it's a it's pretty uh, pretty three, <laughs> three hit points. Yep. All right. So it's just a he, it's just a flavor. Yeah, he takes the hit, uh, like right right is in in its face. And then he just mumbles. I'm going to remove the the, the the gag he has in his mouth. All right. Um, as you do this, he just spits on the ground a, a bit of blood and, and spit. And he just uh, tells you, you guys sucks. You guys are dead. Well, you're in a bad situation for telling us we are dead. And I would more. require you to be polite, mister. Um, and I'm giving in another bash. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Roll for attack with advantage. You're doing it uh, with your armor, armor right? War armor, yeah. 20. And uh, <laughs> interrogation. Yeah, a, eight, punch, eight a punch doesn't work. Damage. Eight? Yeah. I don't want to kill him. 
I never want to kill him. No, I, 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 I got that. All right. I, 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 I tell you to someone like, hey, easy, easy. You're going to kill him. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking out for him, and I, I got, I got my things to uh, make sure he doesn't die. Okay, okay. <laughs> um, at this one, you can also make a, 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 a intimidation check with what you said and yep. the bash that you yeah. you did. I tried to avoid that because I have plus one, so that makes of an eight. He just spits on the ground. Where are you? I'm already dead. You kill all my friends. I'm just saying. I have more friends and they're gonna come for you. You got too many feet in your mouth. You might want to spit out some. I'm gonna... Yeah, I, I grab him. At, <laughs> at you at, at the same time. <laughs> I grab him by the the, the... the the shirt. And I'm gonna ask him... The teeth uh, getting into my beard. Oh. <laughs> How many of you there is? How many red brand there is? I won't tell you. I'm gonna headbutt him then. <laughs> <laughs> Roll for that. That's just like <laughs> sheer, sheer violence. And... Yeah. I just um... want to say, just just as a as a player, because <laughs> I would I would do this differently usually, but. My guy's really pissed off about that arrow. <laughs> Got a 16? All right. It's four points it's... of uh, bludgeoning damage. And I'm going to ask one more time. How many of you there is? He is he's pissed on the ground. Make a intimidation check also. Oh boy. Can I guide him? So the, I'll guide him. It rolled on the floor. I got, hold on. I gotta go check. <laughs> You're gonna guide him? Yeah. In intimidation? I'm gonna, say, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say, uh, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna like, uh, touch his back. Ooh. To boost his voice a bit, okay. and uh, and pray to Kalimbor, and and mention a whisper a few words. Uh, is it so? It's verbal and somatic. So I'll whisper a few words, touch his back, to make his voice boom. So you have one d four bonus on your check. It's it's a cantrip or? Yup. Cool. And I'll use it again and again. One d four. Ooh, plus one, nice. That makes it up to 20. Wow, all right. <clears throat> he, he, he spits down, like, he, you see that uh, at this point with, like, how the ba all, all the bashing that you guys uh, um, did, um, he, he's looking very, very rough. And, like, you, you, saw, you see that he's kind of on the verge of uh, going uh, into unconsciousness. So at this point, like it, 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 you see that like his anger uh, as, uh, kind of uh, fell down, and he he, he just wants it to end. Um, so yeah, he's just gonna reply. Uh, you mean how many of like me, or how many total? Total in this town. Uh, I mean, I never really kept count. Um, I don't know, maybe um, 12. Did you say 12? Yeah, 12, 15, around that. I'm like, this town got manipulated by a bunch of not even 20 guys. Is that what you're saying to me? Oh, we're not all, we're not all guys. 
girls. Yeah, I'm not trying matter. to be racist there, motherfucker. No. I mean, there's goblins and bugbears. But in yeah. the rednecks. Ooh, I forgot. Yeah. I forgot all the freaking goblins had something to do with it. Well, there's le there's already less goblins and bugbears, so it's not that bad. Well, sort of. I'm not sure what you're referring to. We're referring to. Well, there used to be goblins up north, and the uh, the Kragma, Well, there's none anymore. Yeah, I'm not talking about those. Ah, oh, crap. So, uh, who's the leader? He said it was a uh... glass staff. Yeah. yeah. You know about you. <clears throat> you know about glass staff. We heard about well, it. a bit. Yeah. I... Yeah. Well. Yeah, he's, he's our leader. And I'm looking at him like, and? Like, hey. like doing this with my, like. <laughs> he's like, mm -hmm. he, he's a wizard. I mean, the name says it. He, he has a glass staff. He's a wizard. I knew it. I, mean, I knew it. What fucking uh, shit. I'm taking I, a rest, I, by the way. I'm going to go in the corner, listen <laughs> to the conversation, and take a short rest. Okay. Do we have any more questions for this guy? I mean, I don't think we're going to get that much more out of him that we already well, know. Well, that's everything you know, man. They're working with goblins, but why? Why are you working with it? Well, I don't like it as much as you like it. Um, it's just some other guy that Glassstaff is tied with. He send, send us bugbears and goblins just to help us out. So are you saying there's goblins in the abandoned manor also? Uh, to the northeast? Yeah. So there's 12 to 15 ruffians around town. But you also no, have... I... No, you, I, I told you, we're not all guys. So there are 15 between... Well, you, you asked there's, total. I asked there's 12, you guys, 15... You want to know how many like me? Or do you want to know total? I gave you the total. Total. Okay, fine. There's 12 to 15 red brands or goblins or I don't freaking care jerks like you that are yeah. in Fendelin. You guys are slow. But yeah, that's what <laughs> I said. We just got in town. We're trying to grip all everything that happened. Do do the town master works with you, or he's just lazy, no, he's just scared? Like and... mm, thought so. You would do <laughs> anything we say. We would. You would do anything we say just to save his skin. Fucking pussy. Mm. Any more questions? Uh. Oh. Mm. All right, guys just gonna, I guess tell us whatever me. you release. No, no, back in the barrel you go. All right. All right, oh, man, what do you guys? I I got two questions. What do you guys want with us, and what do you guys want with this town? All right. What's the big plan here? Well, for the, for the town, it's just the strongest survive. Like we. We got here, we are able to control it, we continue, we don't have big plans. Well, I mean, maybe the boss has. He wouldn't tell us. For you guys, it's just that uh, 
the 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 other guy that the bot is working with and that sends re uh, reinforcement is just he wants to clear out any strangers that comes in the town. I don't know why, but I mean, you. It's a murder party. How, yeah, how do you call the, the guy you you the guy who who, who you lost? Uh, I don't remember the name. The guy you you are you are searching. What? Uh, because I remember when when I get to the to the campaign, there is a guy who you are searching because they he talked to you with the voices or some or something. Um, the rock seekers. Are you the one who got Gunter, the rock seeker? Okay. No. Uh, okay. Okay. I've heard, I've heard the name. We don't got him. So how about you explain to us the and hideout you got at the abandoned place? How many know. people are there? Where do you hide? What's your pattern? Where where is it? You know, most vulnerable. You know what? I'm gonna explain things to you. If you think we're gonna let you go, put yourself in our shoes. You guys try to kill us every day. We're kind of pissed about it. We won't go away, okay? We won't go away. I'm just telling you that right the fucking now. So just to let that sink in, okay? Accept that. Now, if we, if we let you go and we don't go away, you, you're just gonna come to us again, right? I mean, we don't want that. We don't want to kill you for nothing. I would love to kill you, but we killed your friends already. It's kind of, you know, package deal. We would like to let you go, though, right? I'm looking at the rest of the group. Yeah? Well, not now, that's for sure. Yeah, that's right. All right. So if we let you go now, you're going to come back to us. You got to tell everything to your little friends and they, they might just kill you anyway because you told us a lot of things and you know, what's done is done. You told us things. We can tell them you told us things. You're in trouble either way, buddy. You can't go back to your friends now, right? You betrayed them already. You, you betrayed them, right? So how about this? You stay here, stay quiet. And when you go back, when we go back, we come back. If everything is cleared, you can make a uh, life peaceful again with those new villagers, this new village, redeem yourself, do some voluntary work or something. Go and grieve for your friends. Choose the path right? of redemption. Yeah, so I just wanna say, I did some. I did a burial for them, all right? They're buried somewhere. They have a tomb. You can go see them. Only if you collaborate with us, you show you can redeem yourself, and we're good. I, we got coin. We got coin. We can give it to you. You can redeem yourself. You can make you lose new life again. <laughs> Make a persuasion check with advantage. No, <laughs> <That works. laughs> I can <laughs> believe you, you put everything. And at this point, you can, like, you, you see that you, you raised in the eyebrows when you said that you buried his friend and that he, he could go, like, see them. I got persuasion. I got a 20. Total. Wow. All right. Um. Uh. Man, uh, I, you really buried my friend? Well, <laughs> I'm, a, I'm, I'm a cleric of Kalimvor. It's kind of my job. I even scream at her because she tried to take their stuff. But just and one. their stuff is with them still, you know. And uh, don't worry, uh, I'm not in conflict with her or anything. I still this down. Fuck, I'm talking too much. <laughs> um. Uh, oh, oh. I'm getting uncomfortable when I'm talking about the, you know, friends I killed with, 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 you know, with people, you know. <laughs> I, I, 
yeah, I, I, I get it. Um, uh, yeah, uh, that, that, that makes sense. Uh, I, well, I don't know, like, I don't know what kind of information is good for you guys. Uh, I understand what okay. you say. Like, if I help you, uh, can we kill that wizard? You think we can? I don't know. Yeah, well, you see, well, you fought with us. Yeah, you seem strong, but he has some tricks. Like what? Tell us. The more you tell us, the more you get out of here alive. Because if we don't, you don't. Right? You get you get me, right? So, um, the our our mansion is guarded by a one-eyed beast. By what? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The Do one, the it... one-eyed beast, right? Oh, okay. oh shit! Is it okay. a snake? Is Do it I know a what worm? It is? <laughs> um, I, I, I don't know. Why, why would you know? Well, well, is it okay? Describe, describe that beast to us, please. I, do. I, I, I don't go much. I try to avoid him. Uh, like, in the beast doesn't really want to be. Uh, seen either. It's just that the boss struck a deal with it. He gave him food, and he, he leaves us alone and guard the lair. Hmm. A one-eyed beast. But is it a like a giant or is he like a demon? Is he a humanoid? Fiend. Um, yeah. I I don't know. Um, I guess it's, yeah, it seems evil, but I don't know nature. I'm gonna look at you, monsters well, with evil characters. In my book, you're all evil until you decide to not to be, okay? <laughs> <laughs> to be or so not. So the beast, that beast, they let, they, right. he, it lets you go, it lets you come and go to the lair, yeah. as you please. Okay, yeah. you've never seen it. Well, I mean, it's not the only entrance, so I try to avoid it, but... Uh, oh, yeah. now we're talking, that's what we want to... That was the second question, you know? <laughs> can you make... Can you draw a map of the place? Oh, please, that would be so helpful. I mean... And, uh, do we I'm have paper? All, <laughs> I'm all tied up. I have paper. I mean, um, uh, I need. I kind of need to discuss with my friends here. I think you're good. I, I think you're. You, you know, you let it sink in a bit, okay? And then we'll well, we'll see what we can do about those uh, rope. Okay. Yeah, our strike. You mean? Nah, we're past that, right? And I put a a, a hand on his shoulder. And I'm looking at him in the eyes, and we're, we're we're past that, right? We can't trust you now, right? Yeah, well, I mean, we uh, inside, check. inside check, inside check, and fucking inside check. Inside on what? You didn't speak. I <laughs> realize. Okay, go ahead. Sorry. What? What? Uh... What did he answer? Uh, I I was gonna say um. Uh, I mean, if you untie me, then we can say that it's even. Now, what I mean is, can we count on you? Uh, are, are you a friend now? Are we friends now? And that's what I want to know. Yeah, well, I'm saying we can start talking about being friends when I'm untied. Mm. Well, it's, it's kind of a one-way situation here. Right? Either we trust you and we untie you, or we don't trust you, and you know, yeah, fine. whatever happens, happens. Yeah, fine. I I trust you guys. Inside check. <laughs> <laughs> I got a, a thirteen. All right. Uh, yeah. He, he at this point, like, yeah, he's on the verge still on of unconsciousness and. Um, he doesn't seem to have the energy to, to lie. You just broke him and, uh, okay. he, he's telling the truth. Just. 
I realized that I have a um a manacles um a manacles yeah, yeah. Nice. I don't know <laughs> in my that could that could have been very helpful yeah I just realized right now the next time I'm going to use it <laughs> I'm like why your character have that. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I just For buy the. Uh, is. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> I just buy it in in a in a one of the year uh, for adventures. This one package for adventures, and that yeah. was all that. Manacles shit. in there. <laughs> yeah, there were manacles <laughs> and a hammer. Cool, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, and a and a hammer, but it's a, a little hammer, like uh, for just. It's useful uh, when you're adventurous. Exactly. Your adventure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Hmm. Right. I'm gonna kind of stepping back, getting into the group. So what do we do? What do we do? What do, we do? Well, if uh, he can draw us a map that will will helpful for us. Uh, but I don't know. We going to keep him here we have well, two options we ask hell yeah hell yeah to keep him here but it's it's not really the safest place to keep him i'd say uh i believe as i remember in the town hall there are cells there's prisons mm -hmm. and sildor could possibly keep him there there's also the fact that the, that the town master is a freaking pussy. That's a possibility, but we have... Yeah, he, he, he's going to be released. But, well, or not. Or not. With Sildor. We have Sildor that we kind of... We saved the guy. I mean, he has to do a bit his way, and he wants to change the town. That's the beginning of it. If you have a criminal, you keep him in a cell. You know what? I think that we should we should get out the information that that guy betrayed his friends so that he doesn't have anywhere to go to except us. But if we get out with him and if someone see us with the guy... Oh, we still have a barrel. Oh no, we can drag <laughs> him through town. That's gonna send a message. No, no, but I'm not... Okay, okay. I'm not saying dragging as drag but he can walk with us to the town hall wearing his dirty shirt and red things it's gonna send a message that things are changing basically i should we should be able to get the message around so what do you say do we bring him to the town hall and we try to well, we're going to have to go to the manor eventually. So, and we have a one-eyed uh, snake we have to take care of. I'm seeing yeah. snake. Well, I don't know if it's a there's snake. There's another entrance, right? Maybe he could lead us there. Oh, okay. The first step is we need to ensure his loyalty by making sure he doesn't have anywhere to turn out to. Telling everyone he actually gave us information we couldn't get otherwise. So the idea of dragging him in town, uh, around town, is good. It's even better if we drag him around town. You know, kind of screaming that information that he gave us. Mm. There's one. There's one. There's two ways of doing that. Either he stands with us, or if we force him to actually follow us in town. You know what I mean? 
So the yeah. big question is now, should we untie him or not? Well, I if we untie him and he follows us, it's a stronger message to them. It means that he joined our side. Yeah, he I think more. I think we can untie him. And um, I still suggest going to the town hall with him. And we can... I, I, it's a long shot, probably, but what if he really wants to turn a new page? We go to the town hall with him. Then he shows off, uh, shows us the, the secret entrance, let's say, and he, then he goes back to the town hall. I mean, it's either he goes back, hall? Uh, he goes back to the town hall to be to to, to get detained. For the moment, I know it's He'll a long get shot. Killed. Remember, the town hall is kind of theirs. So if they want to kill him, it's in the town hall. They could, they will be able to do. Well, not not if they're busy with us in their own manner. Well, we can. Is there a way to ensure that? We can say, Seldor, that uh, he he can take care of the guy. And uh, the day we going to just go to the manor, we going to the guy for he show us the other entrance. And then we enter and we fuck the guys and that's it. But he has two options. Either he flees Fendelin because he doesn't want to become a model citizen or he, he just he goes back and he becomes a model citizen there's two options for him because we're gonna be in the matter already so he cannot go back in exactly can i have a oh. short rest now <laughs> with all this <laughs> Well, you kind of took part of most of it. Um, well, it was mostly talking, though. Yeah. Talking yeah. is good. It's, I would, it's, up I would, it's up to you. No, I, uh, I would say uh, you, you can take a short rest. Eating, drinking, reading, and tending to woods. <laughs> well, I mean, I it, would have, talking, is it? it would have started after the beating. Yeah. But after the beating, you pretty much just talk, so if you were sitting in the corner, it's fine. Just during that scene, is if I'm only talking, is that considered a short rest? It's a, that's the question. Yeah, you can talk and uh, tend to your wind. So after that scene, whatever happens, depending on it, I'll, I'll take a short rest on that. Um, just just the, like while you were talking, at some point you have said, and at in, at the same time, I'm, I'm bandaging my my arrow wound. Yeah, yeah, kind of, kind of, but yeah, kind of. And I'm I'm turning t to him and and I'm saying uh to the group, sorry, I'm saying you guys still want me to talk to him or, you, or you, does someone want to take his side? I feel like I kind of bonded with him a bit. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. well, are you guys I'm in going the same back room to the or? yeah. Well, but more clo well upstairs. We talked upstairs because we talked a lot. <laughs> Somewhere where he cannot hear us. That's that's the most important part. So okay. we agree that we free him, and we give him the options of becoming a model citizen and reports to Sildor, or just leave town after he shows us the secret entrance. Yeah, something like that. Whatever he does, I don't really mind. I want to give him a chance, you know? Well, that's his chance. We untie him, and he has those two that's options. Right. Yeah. <laughs> I'd like him to suffer a lot, though, if he betrays us. <laughs> that's the funniest part. How about we get Sildor to watch him? We never asked his name. Do we I don't care? care about his name? Well, well, though, we are going to be friends. 
Ah, uh, that's right. We're, we're not really gonna be friends. We're just g not gonna be the ones who's gonna bash his call in. It's a bit different. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go back uh, downstairs, see the guy. Can um, someone, can one of the, one of two of you go get Seldor? Yeah, I'm, I'm going for Seldor. I'm gonna right. go with her. All right. Okay. So, awesome. I'm gonna I'm explain to the guy. Yep. So, we came to the conclusion that you're gonna be free. Congratulations. But you have... Okay. Kind of a couple things to do. First, we need to know where the secret entrance is. You're gonna have to show us. And you have two options. Option number one is you're gonna have to be under uh, supervision. I'm gonna say it like that from our good friend at the town hall. That is not a town master because we don't work with pussies. And. <laughs> Or the other option is you just leave Fendelin, all in all. But if you leave Fendelin, your chances of survival are pretty low. I think you should stick around. Yeah. Um, I mean, you guys beat me up, so yeah. I don't think I can take a uh, the road right now uh yeah uh, I, even if you're feeling good we want to make sure you help those townsfolk and you redeem yourself you know what it means redeem yourself i do yes all right so you gonna talk we <laughs> until my friend <laughs> wait uh Fern, do you have anything else to ask him or tell him? Not really, no. All right. I'm, I'm going to take a pose. And uh, have we untied him? Uh, uh, yep. No. So do you... What 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 is the options you want? Because either way, I'm going to untie you. But you have to tell me which one... Do you prefer? You said you were not going to be able to take the road, so you got to stand Fendelin. Yeah. Okay. I will. With right. your so-called chaperone. Well, you'll see. He's more than a chaperone. Who is he talking about? Sildor. Sildor. Oh. Yeah. Um, so uh, I'm going to untie him. But I'm well, keeping, I... like, I'm staying right beside him. All right. Anyway, I'm, like... at, I'm at the stairs, so we're, we're kind of being careful. All, like, suspicious all the way, nah, nah, nah. but, um. All right. So, yeah. I... Uh, what did he say? Uh, shit. I lost my track of thought. Yeah, I'm, I'm giving him the big peach about you know the redemption and the life of crime and you know um you. how it's never too late but you don't get two second chances and you know stuff like that like a big clerical speech while we tend to our wounds so i'm gonna tend to his wounds and mine All right until sir little comes back I think just a general charisma check. You sound like Matt Mercer. I have a semi croquant. Ooh. <laughs> you know that sounds like croissant, right? Croissant. Huh? Semi croissant. Oh. I don't see it. Oh, wait. Wait. You don't. Wait. Do wait. 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 Yeah, it's a 20. Is that a 20? Wow. <laughs> That's my second one in the evening. That's <laughs> that guy's going to betray me. That guy's going to betray me. So as you uh as you tend to his wounds and uh wounds. Beat, 
Wounds. Or should just say wounds for me. <laughs> Why wounds? Why? Because that's what yeah, he was you... going to say. <laughs> but I catch myself. I do that a lot because. <laughs> I don't know why, until it got, get, like, until it comes out, I, I never, some of Oh man, are like, you working all words, day in English? Yeah. Oh man. But it's not always, and it's fine, like, uh, but some words I, I need to hear myself say it before I actually, like, notice that it's not the right way. Um, working on it. Love you. Uh, <laughs> I'm, in, so, uh, I'm empathizing. <laughs> Not judging. All right. Um, so yeah, as you um, tend to his wounds and um, do your speech, he, he seems like um, in his thought, and like he, he seems to be like looking in uh, in the the void and just like drinking your uh, your um, your speech and what you're saying. And it seems to be making a big impact on 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 him, and uh, he he starts looking to you uh, up a lot more after that. And I use my you know my shady background because <laughs> I have lots of shady background, <laughs> so I, I use personal experience to to enhance that you know. But yeah, he, um, so yeah, he's just uh, rubbing his uh, wrist and uh, shaking away a bit, being stuck in a barrel for a long time. He asks, uh, you guys have any uh, change of clothes? I'm filthy. Uh, let me go check. I don't have any on me, but maybe, hell yeah, I have some stuff. I'm going to go. You keep hell an eye on him, Senna? Yeah. I will. Going I up. think he's. I think he's cool. I think he's cool. No <laughs> one ever sat through a whole sermon. Is that the word? Um, speech. Speech. Sermon. Speech is a sermon. Sermon. Like a priest uh, talking and yeah. talking. Yeah. A whole sermon. And not. And really, I I, I could tell he's a, he was listening. So I, I think he's good. He's a pal now. What? Pal? A pal? He's a pal. A pal. He's one of the crew. So I, I just find just a uh, name Speeder, by the way. I might forget that. So I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna give you my hat just because I'm sorry in advance. And I give him my hat. All right. It's an important okay. hat. You keep it. Okay. You, Stay you're strong, just, buddy. You're, ju you're just not raising your hat. You're actually giving. I'm giving him. I'm putting him. In, putting it. Put, putting it. <sighs> some some man in English. Some things. They don't flow. I'm right. putting it and putting it, putting putting it in on his head. Putting would be good. <laughs> <laughs> you could you catch that you catch that <laughs> I, I I am putting it on his head <laughs> Alright he takes it like lift at it a bit put it back He seems grateful So are you serious? saying Are you saying your name back or <laughs> <laughs> No. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Alright, so, uh... Uh, so, uh, actually... No, I would, because I have to, uh... While you think about it, we're gonna go to, uh, Tamara and Cade. Moving, uh, to the... Uh, do I have to mark the... I was like, call me Captain Un. <laughs> All right, uh, Captain Un. That's right. Um, the Tongue Master. All just, in... just don't say Pierre or Guy, and we'll be all right. Cur. Ah. <laughs> G G G G G G 
I say don't say it. Yeah. I'm bringing my Warhammer. <laughs> Alright, uh, so, so uh, Tamara and Cade, you uh, walk uh, around the road and make your way to the Townmaster Hall, um, entering it. You see... Mm -mm -mm. Just give me a minute. Where's that guy? So as you enter, um, the town masters all has thirty stone walls, a pitch uh, wooden roof, and a bell tower at the back. Uh, posted on a board next to the front door is a notice written in common. Uh, it reads, reward arcs near the wyvern tower. Um, those of a mind to face the orc menace should inquire within. The notice bears the town seal and an indecipherable signature. And uh, I'm going to, since it's the first time that you guys go to uh, the town master, I actually have this thing. Uh, okay. That's what you see, kind of on um, on a town board right next to the town master hall. Mm. <clears throat> There's always quests on the billboard. Always, <laughs> you can pick them up. <laughs> okay. Um, and yeah, you you. So that's just something that you notice as you enter in. Um, I don't know if you guys uh, need to see. It. At this point, I can give it to you guys. I think. I can make it. Um... That's what. That's what. It's like a like a pretty fine campaign is, is like playing a video game. You know. Yeah. He goes to that cleric. <laughs> I got one quest for you. I, like, I actually, exclamation point. It says that it's in your journal since I showed it to you, so you guys can see it in the journal part of uh, Roll Twenty. Yep. I think it's. Uh, oh yeah, you can we see can it? look at that. Yeah. Wait, yeah. All right, so you have that. Oh. Um, so yeah, as you uh, walk in, uh, there's a Sildar at the back uh, at in an office, and uh, there's also uh, at another office, uh, well, a desk uh, closer to the door. You see um, a fat, pompous old fool, and he looks at you. Oh, greetings. Um, what can I do for you? Well, um, we have something <laughs> in the in the minor exchange. So I think you 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 should go with us. Um, I uh, I don't know you guys. Um, oh, I th are, I I was thinking I was talking with Silver. <laughs> No, you're you're talk, talking uh, with the the fat guy at the at at the entrance. Uh, Sildar, at this point, Sildar notice you and like waves at you. Um, Kate waves <laughs> back. You too. Oh, uh, so, sorry. We 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 we're going to see our friend. So. Oh, Sildar. Um. Yeah. Okay. Thanks. Uh, go go for it. So you you walk to uh, Sildar's desk. Hey guys, how are you? What 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 can I do for you guys? Uh, we have some business in the manual exchange right now, so we need that you going with us. Oh, it's just a yeah. moment. Great. Uh, yeah, that that that's actually great because uh, I was thinking of going there to meet uh, Alia that you talked to me about. So yeah, yeah I think uh, should be a good time. Uh, let me just wrap things up here and um, yeah, uh, I'll, I'm going to fool, fool you guys. Okay. Um, so yeah, he's just uh, like folding papers, putting stuff in his desk and he starts following you. Um, as he passed by uh, the fat guy, he just says, uh, hey, uh, hey, Arben, I'll be back. See you in a bit. Um, so yeah, you walk your way back to, um, the miners exchange. So you enter, 
to you bring him to... All right. Oh. Wow, hey. What's that guy doing here? <laughs> well... It's our new friend. Is he a red brand? Yes. And I right. think he's with the hat and, and, and everything. Yes. Was I about uh, to find well, him new clothes? Or I, I didn't ask well. Uh... I mean, do you, does any of you ask clothes on? No, but I went back inventory? upstairs to naked. ask. Hell yeah. <laughs> um, Hell she yeah. Doesn't have it. Oh, crap. <laughs> So well, uh, well, I don't know what happened here because he have a uh, the hat and everything. So I mean, well, maybe uh, he want to redeem his sins. So we need you, Selder, for take care of the guy while we kill the red hats. I confirm, uh, as you can see now, this guy, tap him on the back, was a red brand, but he wants to turn a new page. Okay. Mm. So you, you want me to keep an eye on him, or what exactly are you uh, asking for me? Well, I believe you have cells, you have somewhere to put people in the town hall. And maybe if you can search for clothes for him please well actually before talking about cells let's say you two are gonna become best buddies you're gonna help out each other and watch each other's back yeah you're you're friend finding me a lot of friends this time around i'm talking him i'm thinking him on the side and like Telling him to lean down a bit. Wait, to who were you talking to? Uh, Sil Sildor. Sildor. Sildor okay. Yes. So Sildor said we're finding him a lot of friends. Okay. Yeah, because you, you, like... you told him that uh, Alia was uh, his new wife. And then now uh, you found his best buddy. So is he leaning in? Yeah. Okay, I'm whispering, that's kind of the point of a rebellion. Make friends. Right. Yeah, no. Um, I was just, get that. I was just messing with you guys. That's my, that was a joke. Oh. Right. That was um, a bad one. Yeah. I, <laughs> hmm, uh, I'm not, I'm not the joke kind of guy but now we're, we're okay don't talk about it, it makes it weird <laughs> <laughs> all right um so yeah uh so you're gonna redeem yourself so what what kind of what are you good at what can we make you do and red brand just like raised the hat a bit he, he just said well wow, I'm good at fighting for now. Uh, so, so that just says, uh, um, all right, um, I guess we can try to build the guards. Yeah, I think we need guards in this city. If you, any points at all of you guys are going to like get rid of this cancer then um i guess we will need guard in the city to keep the peace so yeah i agree you're gonna yeah. need some sort of militia so there's a presence in the town that kind of uh, persuade others not to make another band of ruffians like the red brand so if there's already yeah. a militia nobody's gonna do like oh we can control the town. No, because it's already under control. Yep. Yeah, no. Um, yeah, if if the, the guy proves himself and being um, 
rough guy and and able to handle this uh, itself then yeah we i guess uh we're gonna be the stepping stone to building something um that resemble any form of guards in the town uh first he's gonna lead us to uh well he he needs to draw out a map of the hideout no nah, he's gonna he's just gonna lead us to him to 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 the back door it's gonna be a yeah, lot easier then what then yeah. why not a yeah. map yeah i mean um i don't have <laughs> i don't have great drawing skills but map would probably help you guys he said he said he was good at fighting not drawing so basically yeah but i mean it's better than nothing fine yeah if i can i don't know get something more comfortable on and something to eat maybe um, yeah, so I'm Sil going to. Sildor, can you provide for that? Um, I, we can I bring don't him have, at the end. I don't have anything on me. There's a free room for him. Keep him close, you know. <laughs> That's true. So you can tell to Dublin that they give give them food and then we're going to pay it. All right. So you you guys make your way to the inn with um, the ruffian and Sildar as a group yep. or ruffian yep. unbound, yeah, yeah. and he walks yep. uh, in the middle of us surrounded, so he doesn't have any mean of escaping in a way, even if he tries. All right. Or 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 maybe some someone is trying to kill him. So we have to watch too. Yeah. So we're in the productive formations that uh Yep. Okay, great. It's a kill circle. All I'm gonna be up front because I have keen eyes. I'm gonna be in the back since I can see like all on top of your heads. <laughs> Not blocking the view to certain people. No, no, no. <laughs> so Tamara and Kate, you're you're on the flanks. Yeah. Yep. And Sildar is gonna walk with you, Kate. Yeah. Okay. I just thought he was gonna. I'm Sildar. <laughs> All right. Uh. So uh, do you? Want just you a second. I'm taking a... my short rest now. <laughs> it's a... Boop. Boop. Oh no, I had a... No, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, why is he not taking the Wendy? Oh, I have to roll it. Yeah. That's, Are we playing uh, that we have to roll it or that we're taking the average? Well, we always roll for everything else, so. All right. I'll be rolling. My DA. You're rolling for what? Ooh. Healing? The short rest to get, gain hit point. He's using it. Because I, I, lo I, I lost like a. Uh, Seven? <laughs> Yeah, thirty percent of my HP. So <laughs> taking it back. It, how much did you get? Uh, I rolled an eight. Great. So I got it all back. Good. <laughs> all right. So, uh, do you want to uh, roll a perception check since you're in the front? I do. End? Here's a proof, motherfucker. I don't need poop. 
I don't know what you wanted me you to say you. after you. I asked you how many, how much you got. You tell, you told me, and like that's it. I got, I got fourteen, uh, fourteen plus five perception. He's the proof. This is the proof. <laughs> you want the proof? This is the proof. <laughs> we don't see the don't same, but sure, sure. <laughs> we don't even see it. I know it is. It was a joke. Um, so, uh, uh, 14, uh, 19 total perception. Nice. Um, so, yeah, you guys make your way uh, to the inn. Um, this is are... not good music for that. Sorry, go you ahead. You are... Um, yeah, you are keeping keeping watch. Uh, there is uh, people uh, watching and giving you weird uh, looks because you're carrying with you uh, a ruffian that's clearly as still the red brand, like the red. You, brand. you still yeah. got that motherfucker, and I'm ripping it off him. Don't worry, guys. Everything's good. You can trust us. He. He's a, he's with us now. He told us about the big uh, hideout. Told us about the big monster. And I'm screaming, screaming that it's all good. It's all good. All right. <laughs> yeah, people are just uh, watching you pass by. Uh, that guy is going to work. die. <laughs> Someone <laughs> is going to kill him. <laughs> Giving uh, you guys weird looks and uh, yeah. Um, uh, us or him? The whole, the whole shebang, the whole group. Uh, well, if if my if my talks don't uh, work, no, but I uh, mean, uh, I you, have too you, high of a wisdom to give a finger to everyone, but that's what I'm thinking. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I mean, it, they just find it very uh, weird. Not. It, it, it's not that they seem angry or anything. They're just mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. cur curious and, um, um, yeah, weird out. He just gets a lot of looks for uh, going around with, with this guy. All right. So you make your way to the inn. Um, I use prestidigitation. Prestigitation. Prestig. 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 Mm -hmm. Prestidigitation. Prestidigitation to yes. clean his clothes. Oh, interesting. Uh, what does that do? I don't even know. It's it just... cleans his clothes. <laughs> no, you, I can clean an object up to one cubic foot, and I can make lots of fluffy bunny stuff. It's a, it's a magic <laughs> laundry machine. Yeah, I, uh, or dishwasher. Uh, copy paste of the spell incoming in the chat. I we will not read it all because <laughs> you will understand right now. It's not that bad. Oh, you! Yeah. I thought you would put in the stat the roll twenty chat. What? Oh no, we don't reuse that anymore, uh -huh. right? Yeah, come on. Since we all have our dice, is our die dice? We're not using Oh, them. we use the uh, the roll twenty chat. We do. No, I mean we don't. It, it, oh, we don't. <laughs> okay, great. Nobody. It doesn't matter. Awesome. It's just that last time people were putting stuff in roll twenty, other were not. Uh, I just didn't expect. All right. Reward good. orcs near Wyvern Tor. Point exclamation. Those bold in face orc menace should inquire within. Oh, you're reading the note. Um, yeah. All right. So, uh, so yeah, you the the clothes uh, magically just cleans, um, and yeah, he, he looks at you. Does he notice that it's you, or it's just uh, he he just looks at himself. Wow. Um. Well, that's surprising. That's impressive. And he keeps walking. So yeah, you enter the inn uh, with a very clean red brand that doesn't have his red brand anymore. So just a guy. We come um, in with a random guy. 
Yeah. And you sit uh, at the table. Uh, Toblins comes to you. Uh, hey guys, uh, what, what will it be uh, for for you? Uh, I'll take beer for everybody without carrots in it, please. No carrots. <laughs> Well, I mean, and, the, uh, the carrots are brewed inside the beer. God damn it. What but, have you um, done, Samet? I, 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 have, I, like, I have the old batch, so... I'll take some of the old one. I, yeah. I liked All it. Right. Yeah, I, I, I can do that. Yeah, of course. And also, uh, we're going to need food for our uh, new friend. Oh, uh, Anybody else wants food? What is I your dare. name? Uh, my na name's Peter. Peter? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Car. Uh, all right. Uh, yeah. Uh, and what what does Peter would like to eat? Here says, um, just meat. Give me like meat and potatoes. Uh, all right. Uh, yeah. Right away. Oh, by the way, by the way, uh, the uh, Pete, Pete, right? He's got a. He he needs to pay for the meals. He needs he needs to be really uh on the redemption road. So he needs he yeah. No favors, please. Um, um, does Peter as uh, a way to pay? And Peter, Peter is just um well. No, I I don't have anything on me. I pay for him just to give them the mail in. Just maybe just he once. could work. I said, wait, maybe he could work with you for like a day or something to pay for the meal. Okay, that sounds better. Um, well, we have plenty of staff, but yeah, I guess we could find something for him to do for uh, a beer and. Uh, and a meal. I don't know. He's gonna maybe. stay anyway because he he's kind of uh staying with us. Clean the dishes, and I... everything. Yeah. All right. Uh, so a cheap meal for the guy and a beer for everyone, right? Yep. Uh, no beer. No beer. No beer. Yeah, no, I I I had it rough last time for me, and no beer for me. All right, so a dwarf for... that doesn't take a beer, I'll be damned. Hey, that's racist. <laughs> that's not racist. That's just common knowledge. All right, so a uh, cheap meal for Peter, a uh, beer for you, Kate, Tamara, and Fern. Right? Yeah. You have some bacon leftovers. Uh, yeah, sure, always. Uh, so bacon for for you. All right, I'll come back with that. And he makes his way out. I forgot Sildar. I guess Sildar is going to have a beer also. Uh, give me, give him a carrot beer. It? Sorry? What time of day is it? Uh, at this point, it's not noon yet. Um, I'd say it's around maybe... Eleven. Okay. Zana, I I know we said about we would stop about ten. So the way it is, if we finish the day, uh, it would be up to eleven o'clock. So I don't. I, I would, I'm just putting what? it out there. Okay. Oh. Then we say we were gonna finish uh, at ten. Oh no, because we started at seven thirty. But well, I don't mind. Like it, it's up to you guys. If you guys are I'm tired, saying, yeah. we uh, we can finish here. But I thought you you were asking what time is it in the game. Yeah, because no, because uh, if we were time? like at night, it would be a good a good ending point. Yeah, in no, the middle it's... of the day. Then there's the rest of the day to go through. Yeah, no, yeah. it's not uh, like you guys just. Uh, you chased some guys, you argued with another guy, walked a bit around, and you woke yeah. up pretty early. You didn't so do it... much. 
that's right. <laughs> Quite a bit of role play, uh, but not a lot of fighting. Well, yeah, but... a lot of running. <laughs> yeah, skill challenge is like fighting. It's an encounter, basically. <clears throat> Which you get XP for. Yeah. Hey. Um. So I'm just putting it out there. I, I can I can keep going, no problem. It's just it's my uh, it's my DM side that's <laughs> big problem. Just just uh, looking at ahead, you know, if we get into encounters and stuff like that, uh, we could go up to eleven. If it's a, if that's already for everyone, I don't mind. I'm saying it out. No, we can continue the next uh, the next week. And uh, we can uh, get prepared for uh, the battle and everything because, I mean, we're going to search this guy, so we need to prepare them. Mm. Take a long rest. And, yeah, and we'll save it for next week. Yeah, all right. Because if and we continue uh, on this journey, <laughs> we're probably going to get into something that's going to last a bit too long, so... Yeah. That's what I had in mind. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, sounds good. Um, 